All right, let's go. Light it up. Woo! Our first clinic was, um, you know, kind of a spin-off from Laxer Life. We had done Laxer Life in the summer, and, and we came out here and kind of just did that same format. You know, we didn't know, really know what, you know, what to expect if we were going to be able to get enough kids to do a whole program. But it turned out we had a great turnout for the camp, and it was a good way to just, you know, get our foot in the door out here and, and to, you know, build something uh, pretty special here. <laughs> gives the kids an opportunity to uh, you know continue with the cross and further their education as well I know I I took advantage of this opportunity um, the cross you know it helped me out academically and you know brought me to where I am today as far as post-secondary education and you know continuing on to my professional career when you learn the creators game different tribes had different spiritual beliefs on how that ball should be passed you know, and what it does for individuals and families and, and reservations and what they can offer for that. At that time, we felt it was just a ball, but we had elders that told us different. You know, when this ball rolls, the whole earth moves, you know, and, you, and it's up to individuals to make that move. We call it tapash kashkan, the moving uh, ball, <laughs> like that. With it comes up the, the gift of life as it turns you know, because it turns all the time life turns all the time creative games to me um that you know that just having pride in, in uh, the opportunity to play it today just traditionally like you know i'm native american and they've been playing this game for many years now. I play the game for the creator to have fun, just to hang out with my friends. To be able to come back in their community and to pass this on to the next generation, that is our whole real goal here is that, you know, that we build this thing where, you know, these they can hand it down to their children. It's the only Indian team in the Minnesota area. It kind of describes where, who they are and you know what they they pride themselves on. Well, it means everything to me. I've been playing with them for three years and they're like a family. In the native community it's a birthright to have a lacrosse stick. You know when my son was born I gave my son a lacrosse stick and that's what we're trying to build here is the you know show them the heritage of the game and, and the meaning behind it. I'm proud that I can be a part of it. I've learned to respect people a lot more and I've just gotten a lot more respect. I treat people how I want to be treated and play fair, do everything fair. It was a war game before and you know to play it for, for pure passion and enjoyment is, is a great opportunity for me. It's just really good to keep the game going and you know play it and respect it as much as I can with pride. <laughs> <laughs> 